Hey. I don't know what you were thinking, trying to get close to those Shogunate officials. Let's talk, just for a while. Understood? What is it? Is that how it looks? In truth, I live in a constant state of fear. But if you give in to cowardice and don't act, then the things you could and should achieve will be left undone. Which is why I try to remain firm in my resolve, no matter what. But, but don't tell Shinsaku and the rest I said any of that, all right? You know how to please. Understood. Be seeing you. Oh, pardon me. What about? What is it? This is really lovely. Oh, all right. I have nothing more to say. Hey! Ah, hello. I'm listening. What's that? My father was a smart man, a scholar who even balanced the Daimyo's books. But due to his social standing, he was treated like dirt. How can we hope 
to catch up with the West, when a soldier's son must become a soldier and the retainer's son must walk the same path. When I saw how Western society works, how those with ability are rewarded regardless of their station at birth, I was deeply moved. I want Japan to adopt this principle at all costs, for the sake of my late father too. Hmm, I suppose I'll have to tell you the story. When I was young, I spent all my energy learning Dutch. But when I arrived in Yokohama, all the Westerners spoke English, and English alone. And sadly, my Dutch withered on the vine. Every now and again, I heard people say that learning Dutch was behind the times. But little did I know how right they were. To be able to interact with the West, I have no choice but to become proficient in English. A lesson learned the hard way. I'm learning the ways of the Tatsumi Ryu, yes, but I'm more concerned with AI as a tool to train both body and mind. If I ever got into a fight with truly dangerous swords, I'd run like the wind. I won't die for no good reason. Besides, versing oneself solely in combat is of little value. It's through education that one is able to exert their true potential. How wonderful. Very well then. Till next time. That's fine work. Thanks to you, it looks like we have what we need to revitalize the Shogunate. Now, I had my men look into the samurai you mentioned. Word is they're working for the Brits as an intermediary. Setting up weapon sales with the high and mighty. Something smells rotten, though. And someone in my position can't afford to turn a blind eye. In fact, not all the men I sent to investigate have come back. I have to assume the worst. This has grown beyond your pet project. I need to keep looking into this. But let's leave that conversation for another time. I sent the best of the men you gathered to the military academy, by the way. You should take a look yourselves. It's a new style of dojo, where they teach more than just the sword. Namely, firearm proficiency and horsemanship to Western standards. Ah, oh, that sounds interesting. I might go and take a peek right now. See you there, okay? Man of action, isn't he? Now, there's one more favor I'd like to ask of you. Enomoto says we don't have the funds to buy ourselves guns or artillery. When I mentioned this to Mr. Brunei, he suggested we try selling Japanese crafts at the International Exposition in Paris. Viscount Shibusawa, our money man, will know exactly what to do. 
Will you take this letter and offer him any help he might require? You'll find him at the South Commissioner's office. That's all for now. But don't think I won't ask you for more favors if you come back. Feel free to drop by the Military Academy first, though. You won't want to miss what's going on there. The wise man knows when to beat the retreat. You know, I only steal for the sake of the poor. So, cut me some slack, will you? <laughs> Promise you'll go easy on me next time, eh? Impressive! I wasn't expecting you quite that quick. Truth is, we're being graced with the Shogun's presence today. He's here to observe a little martial arts competition. You'll watch too, won't you? Good! I'll show you inside. This is the shooting range, where they teach Takashima-style gunnery. A vital skill for these changing times. Here's where they practice horseback archery. Eventually, they'll start learning Western horsemanship, too. This is the fencing hall, but it's been converted for the competition. I believe the Shogun should already be here. Hey! Ah! 
Where's Ryoma? Why don't you join him and look around together? Ah, you're finally here. I asked if you could enter the competition, by the way. Nothing. I just thought you'd want to. No need to thank me, by the way. I heard the Shogun himself will give you your prize if you win three matches. Can't say the prize isn't appealing. But honestly, I really just want to meet the Shogun in person. They say he's sharp, you know. And sensible, too. So, are you ready to fight? Then off you go! With your skills, you can't lose. Just go mop the floor with them. His name is Teshu Yamalka. We use the same dueling style, and he's very good at it. He's known to be a tough one. They say he can pierce steel with a wooden sword. Then get going. I'm in your corner, remember. Make me proud. I knew you could do it. How are you feeling about the next match? Teiju Takahashi, the stepbrother of the man you just fought. He's a master of the Jitokuin Ryu, and is so respected for his skill with the spear he was appointed governor of Ise province. Good. Just keep up the momentum from your last fight. I'm counting on you. Ugh! 
more than that to break me! Made it this far. Now you just need to win your next fight. Well, are you ready? A guy by the name of Shigoro Kano. They call him a genius of Jujutsu. He's still just a kid, but underestimate him at your peril. The essence of Jujutsu is that the gentle can defeat the strong. But what that really means is they can throw a guy twice their size across the room. Win this last match, and the prize is yours. I know you can do this. This was an educational experience for you too. May we spar again soon. You did it! The prize is ours! I saw the whole thing. A fine display. Now. How about we test those skills in one last bout? Oh boy. Now you want a piece of the action? As long as you don't make us forfeit the prize if we lose. Now, you made short work of Teshu and Deshu. This time, I think I'll start with my sword drawn. Only joking. <laughs> I wouldn't dream of it. But His Excellency did say he would like to witness you fight one more time. Which is why I, busy though I am, have come to make this request. Oh, and His Excellency has requested real swords for the next duel. Your opponent has already given his consent. No two ways about it, your life will be on the line. So, how about we sweeten the pot to make up for it? After all you've been through, you're not scared of real steel, are you? Just one more bout to go, my friend. Ready to go? I know you're going to win whoever it is you're up against. I believe in you! Amazing! 
Certainly showed me. Hmm? Ah. Hey, I know you. We met in Yoshiwara. <laughs> Mistaken identity, I am sure. I am Yoshinobu Tokugawa, the Shogun. The Shogun? Are you serious? <laughs> Seems I let the cat out of the bag. We had no intention of disrespecting you, uh, Your Excellency. Hey, <laughs> where are your manners? No need to be concerned. Losing to you was invigorating. Invigorating? Indeed. I mean, you dodged a shuriken. Finding warriors like you is no easy feat. Ah, the next bout. With warriors of this caliber, I know I can get Japan back on its feet. I will make our nation the equal of any foreign land. You wait and see. Well, well, you really are something, aren't you? I can't believe you managed to win against His Excellency. <laughs> you should be proud. His Excellency is a master of the shuriken. Feel free to make use of this place from now on. You need to hone those talents of yours. Do you really intend to obey the Imperial Court's order and go to Kyoto? This is a fine opportunity. Kyoto is where we can find those who wish to topple me and put the Imperial Court in my place. So let's get on the front foot and bring this conflict to an end. You didn't think I meant to go unprepared, did you? Tadamori! Sir. As military commissioner of Kyoto, you will go as my advance guard. You may take your pick of my finest warriors. Your Excellency, allow me to gather an army to defend Kyoto. I shall find you truly worthy soldiers from all levels of society. This is madness! You'll attract scoundrels! You'll open the door to traitors! Let them come. We shall deal with them all in one fell swoop. I leave this to you. My lord, now if you will excuse me.
Good day to you. Why, you're looking at him. Is that so? Let me take a look. said exhibitions are a great way to drum up military support, in addition to serving as an opportunity to sell Japanese products to the West. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Eiichi Shibusawa. I am in charge of the government treasury. I have some ideas for items that might garner attention abroad. Perhaps you could assist me? For instance, in procuring ukiyo-e paintings, lacquerware, or even satsuma pottery. Now, if only we had a contact who could help us. Ah, this is knowledge I picked up in my youth. I used to travel here and there on business, you see. Oh, do you have a lead, perchance? Do you happen to know that gentleman? Excellent! 
This should be smooth sailing. Can I ask you to take care of the Satsuma pottery in that case? I'll send word to the Satsuma myself later. When you have made some progress, do let me know. Meanwhile, I shall endeavor to gather the other goods. Who are you? Well, in that case, you may pass. Let Okubo know what your business is. He's by the north stage inside the house. Just make sure you're on your best behavior. So, are you ready? Good. In you go. Why go to the trouble of dismantling it? We must keep the peace within the clan. I fear that we have little choice. You... Why are you here? Apparently, this no stage is going to be dismantled. Many in the Satsuma clan are far more interested in firearms than they are in the arts, you see. That's fine. But first things first. I'm under strict orders to inform a certain someone should you ever appear. I'm just going to get someone. In the meantime, perhaps you could show us your fighting prowess? We are almost eager to see more. That is a lot to ask of a guest. Come, surely you are as intrigued as anyone. Show them what the Satsuma clan are capable of. Then allow us to test your metal. Here I come. Oh, yeah. 
That's my time. What is this strength? Incredible. I thank you for sparring with me. Both of you were most impressive. I owe you for your part in my encounter with the Blue Demon. I thank you. But might I ask, from whence you hail? I see. Do you mean to say that you are a Ronin? Forgive my boldness, but anyone capable of defeating the Blue Demon should definitely be in the employ of the Satsuma. Kuroda is very keen for you to join the Satsuma clan. I share his hopes. What do you say? Is that so? That's a shame, but... So be it. At the very least, you can aid us with this pottery. I received a letter explaining everything. You see? I shall arrange to have it sent to Shibusawa, or whomever it was. Come for pleasure next time, not business. We'll have a drink or two. Okubo included, of course. Count on it. 